Elon Musk finally reveals new graphene battery. Many future changing batteries are under development. From gold nanowire batteries to tank 2 string batteries, automobile companies are trying to make something that can power their vehicles efficiently and for a long time. Elon Musk, CEO of Tesla, seems to have found something before others. So what is the battery technology Musk is going to produce? And how will the EV industry change? Stay tuned to find out more. Batteries, a recent innovation that shines a bright new light on science are the future of science. Batteries have been used for centuries, evolving from the earliest lithium-ion based models to the revolutionary graphene battery that Elon Musk will unveil in 2023. The revolutionary technology that might power the future is the graphene battery. In a bid to guarantee the supply of essential material in a market dominated by China, Tesla Inc. has committed to take the majority of battery-ready graphite from production plants slated for Louisiana. The Australian company said in a statement that Melbourne-based Sierra Resources LTD will provide graphite anode material to Elon Musk's business for an initial period of four years with an option to purchase extra volumes subject to potential expansion at Sierra's Vidalia plant. The Mozambican graphite will be processed at the Louisiana facility to create the first domestic source of graphite anodes for the nation's rapidly expanding lithium-ion battery and electric car manufacturing sectors. According to Sarah's managing director, Sean Werner, over the phone, the agreement with Tesla would support a final investment decision on the production plant that is anticipated next month and help assure local supplies. According to Bloomberg NEF, the demand for graphite, which is used to make materials for anodes, is expected to climb fivefold by the end of the decade. Almost all of this graphite is produced in China. Tesla's Model 3, a $40,000 car, hopes this will make electric cars, EVs, accessible to the general public, has attracted a lot of consumer attention. According to Statista, the Model 3 will sell more than 500,000 units globally in 2020, making it the best-selling plug-in EV model in the world as of right now. As Tesla sells more of its electric vehicles, demand for lithium, graphite, and cobalt is anticipated to rise. This is because lithium-ion batteries powered Tesla's EVs. However, some investors are still speculating about the possibility of Tesla's lithium-ion batteries using graphene, a single layer of crystalline allotrope carbon in the future. Why the Tesla rumors concerning graphene batteries? An anode made of graphite is frequently seen in lithium-ion batteries, which are made up of cathode and an anode. However, the use of graphene technology as a graphene electrode in lithium batteries is a possibility. Although these electrode materials have faced reliability issues, reduced graphene oxide, water, and graphene solution have shown promise in lithium-ion batteries. In addition, energy storage capabilities are significantly enhanced when a metal oxide is joined to graphene. Among other uses, metal oxides are frequently employed in lights, magnets, and superconductors. So is Tesla graphene batteries a possibility? Continue reading to learn what might be in store. Is it possible? A Tesla battery made of graphene? Graphene, the wonder material of the 21st century, has a long list of qualities. It is 200 times stronger than steel, conducts electricity more efficiently than copper, and is nearly transparent. It's also impenetrable to gases. Additionally, when chemical elements are added to its surface, its properties might change. These characteristics allow graphene almost unlimited possibilities. However, the majority of them are currently not readily available on the market. Can better lithium-ion batteries be created using graphene? And if so, is Tesla working toward that goal? The simple response is, not yet, but the situation is more complicated than that. What you need to know about Tesla and graphene in a nutshell. The 500-mile graphene battery, the majority of the information on Tesla's possibly producing graphene batteries, comes from China's Xinhua News Agency. Why? The news source reported that Tesla was developing a graphene battery that could almost quadruple the range of the Model S sedan to 500 miles back in 2014. Elon Musk, CEO of Tesla, adds his perspective. At around the same time that Xenoa report of graphene batteries was published, Musk stated that he believed it would be able to develop an EV with a range of 500 miles. In reality, he remarked, we could accomplish it pretty soon, but the cost would go up. He made no mention of the usage of graphene in the production of such a vehicle, though. 
market observers flocked in. It was understandable that Musk's remark and the report caused a stir in the graphing community. Notably, market observers noted that even though a graphing battery would have excellent mileage, the cost of graphing might make it unaffordable. There is a renewed interest. There was no news on the Tesla graphing battery recently, which disappointed fans. Tesla purchased Maxwell Technologies in the middle of 2019. Maxwell is notable for its fast charging capabilities using supercapacitors. Compared to conventional capacitors, graphene supercapacitors can store enormous amounts of energy. Tesla's graphene battery, difficulties and rivalry. Naturally, there are batteries to making graphite materials for batteries commercially viable. The safety and durability of lithium batteries and EVs are impacted, among other things, by density issues. There are still problems with conductivity, which can eventually reduce the battery's overall capacity. That is the current state of affairs. Although a Tesla graphene battery is undoubtedly an intriguing concept, there has been no indication that the company is working on one at this time. However, other businesses are also intrigued by the concept of using graphene batteries to eventually power electric vehicles. Graphene-enhanced batteries are being developed by Nanotech Energy for use in EVs and portable electronics. Fubon Financial Holding, a financial services corporation with headquarters in Taiwan, recently invested $64 million in the business. Early in 2020, the Spanish company Grafenino announced that it was working with a Chinese partner to create a battery based on graphene polymer that would have a range of up to 500 kilometers and a recharge time of under five minutes. A graphene battery created by a Spanish businessman by the name of Earthdos charges electric motorcycles and bikes in about five minutes. It might just be a matter of time before it can be used for other vehicles. Additionally, in 2020, the Chinese manufacturer of electric cars, GAC Group, revealed that the creation of a battery upgraded with graphene can be charged up to 85% in just 8 minutes. The Ion V electric SUV, which GAC Group recently unveiled, is scheduled to hit the market in the fall of 2021. The graphene battery in the EV, according to the GAC Group, can be charged in a minimum time of 8 minutes without causing damage and has a range of more than 620 miles. Industry insiders are scoffing at the claims, though as many think that such capabilities at scale are still a few years away. The graphene manufacturing group based in Australia also claims to have developed a graphene aluminum ion battery cells that can charge up to 70 times faster than conventional lithium ion batteries while storing up to three times as much energy. The company claims that its graphene aluminum ion cell has recently undergone 2,000 cycles without suffering any performance degradation. According to GMG Managing Director Craig Nicol, the company's cell technology may be adapted to fit into the existing lithium-ion housings found in vehicles. He said we may either change to whatever shape is required or ours will have the same shape and voltage as the existing lithium-ion cells. By 2022, GMG hopes to have prototypes of automotive pouch cells. Overall, it seems like the graphene battery problem won't be solved by Tesla. But given that graphene is regarded as the wonder material of the 21st century, it is feasible that Tesla will eventually produce graphene batteries to compete. Future electric vehicles may use graphene aluminum ion batteries as their main power source since they can charge 60 times quicker than lithium ion batteries and store a lot more energy than pure aluminum cells. For instance, AA batteries can be recharged in a minute and coins sell batteries in 10 seconds using graphene aluminum ion cells. Tesla claimed that it couldn't get enough graphite from other sources and sought the American government to remove tariffs on graphite from China. According to industry estimates mentioned in Sarab presentation, Vidalia's initial 10,000 to year production rate would be able to meet around 3% of the demand for batteries based on the United States by 2025. The world's leading battery and electric vehicle EV manufacturers are scouring the globe to secure supplies of battery materials like lithium, cobalt, nickel, and graphite as the push for a more environmentally friendly future. This concludes today's video. What do you think of batteries made of graphene? And how can they transform the future? Please respond in the comments. To stay up to date on the latest Tesla news, like, share, and subscribe to the channel.